Meghan Markle, the Duchess of Sussex, undertook a charity trip to Rwanda long before she met Prince Harry. The video, posted by World Vision Canada, highlighted Meghan's visit to the African nation. The then suits star paired with the charity, which aims to bring access to clean water to the region. During the trip, the future Duchess met with children who were missing school because they had to travel to collect dirty water that made them sick. At one point, the actress helped with the construction of a well. She said, It feels really cool to be part of this part of the process. It feels really hands on. She went on, It's not just about clean drinking water, but what it's doing for education, for keeping these kids in school, what it's doing for them not having medical bills. I mean, every single piece of it is so interconnected, and I think how this one life source is the cause for all of it. That's been my biggest takeaway from today. Fans were full of praise for the Duchess. Nanda Pasifo wrote, Helping other persons requires a lot of sensitivity which not everyone has against the suffering people in need. You are proving that you are worthy of esteem and respect. Aisha al karusi wrote, Heartwarming, we need more people in this ever so fragile world. Thank you Meghan Markle you are such an inspiration. John Smith wrote, Meghan is just beautiful. In every sense of the word. Kim Yo wrote, she is such a lovely human. God bless her. Lavana Jackson said, This amazing woman is beautiful, strong, and generous. Uck Magno wrote, She has a good heart, down to earth, and doesn't care to do dirty work. Charity work and the continent of Africa have played a huge part in Meghan and Harry's romance. An unusual third date to Botswana in Africa saw the pair fall in love while undertaking charity work. A friend of Meghan's Janina Gavonkar told GMA, I remember when Meghan told me about Botswana. I loved how she was, pleasantly surprised. Like, this boy is actually just doing this for real. This is not some flouncy trip. He really means it. They fell in love with nothing around them. No frills. No bells and whistles. All they had was each other, doing good work in a place where nobody was watching them. They did that separately. Imagine what they can do together.